My name is Jim Estes, and today I'm going to talk about a drill that I think is extremely important for the swing plane. So what I want you to do is, and this, by the way, is going to give you an instant understanding of exactly the feeling you want to have in the golf swing. Take a club. You can put a rod, alignment rod, in the grip, or I'm sorry, in the butt end of the golf club. Take the golf club, turn it like you're going to hold it, and then what I want you to do is take that club, put it right against your left hip, so you're holding both clubs here. Now you've got an alignment rod on the ground and a golf ball. And what I want you to do, getting into your good posture position, your weight over the arches, getting feel balanced. The insides of the heels are going to be about the width of your hips. Take a swing back, slow motion, and trace with that alignment rod the target line all the way up. The shaft should be parallel to your target line at the top. And then slowly coming down, trace the line. And do this in slow motion. Right into the impact position. So this is a great feedback tool, visual feedback tool, for learning the proper swing plane. Go right to your impact position. I encourage you to do this drill in slow motion. And if you have five minutes a day, if you do this drill every day, I guarantee you're going to improve your golf swing. So again, I think you'll find this to be extremely helpful. JimEstesGolf.com if you have any questions. Thought, John, when you get the seven iron in your hand, the ball is going to be just about in the middle. Pay attention to where that ball is in relationship to your stance. You got to have that ball equidistance from your left toe and your right toe, and then you're just going to pin your left upper arm right up against your chest. Make sure you make a good rotation, and you're just going to give it a little bit slower backswing. Feel like you're taking it away smooth and slow. Complete your turn. Get a little pause up there, and then go ahead and hit it. And that's a pretty good swing there. So you don't have a whole lot going wrong in your golf swing. When you go bad, you get the ball too far forward. Uh, you got the seven iron opposite your front foot, which isn't good. Put it right in the middle, and then you got to complete your turn and get a little pause up there. Take it away slow, and you'll be fine. If your right hand takes over, it's going to go left. If you stop turning your body and you don't get your body rotating with your arms moving, the, the key to golf is being able to move your arms and body as a unit so your hands don't play too big a role and close that face up. If you're leaving it to the right, it's because you're too tight in your grip. You've got to make sure you maintain a constant grip pressure. Not too tight, especially at a dress. You don't want to hold it tight at setup. 